What are the best Wes Anderson movies of all time? The American filmmaker known for his distinct style, loyal fan base, and frequent collaborations with Owen Wilson, Bill Murray, and Jason Schwartzman. These movies were ranked using a simple math formula, calculated from actual data available on popular movie websites, including critic ratings, user ratings, the number of votes, and published opinion rankings. For the most part, I left my own opinion out of it. Leave a comment if you want to know more. I have a detailed Excel spreadsheet with about 50 columns of data. Number 10. Bottle Rocket Three friends go on the run after a simple robbery and a harebrained scheme for an as-yet-specified crime spree that somehow involves the supposedly legendary Mr. Henry. Starring Luke Wilson, Owen Wilson, Robert Musgrave, and James Caan. Written by Wes Anderson and Owen Wilson. Bottle Rocket started as a 13-minute black-and-white short film that was first shown at the USA Film Festival and later the Sundance Film Festival before being expanded into a feature film. Number 9. The Life Aquatic with Steve Zissou With a crew that includes his estranged wife, a pregnant journalist, and a man who may or may not be his son, renowned oceanographer Steve Zissou plans to exact revenge on a mythical jaguar shark that devoured his partner. Starring Bill Murray, Owen Wilson, Kate Blanchett, and Willem Dafoe. Written by Wes Anderson and Noah Baumbach. This was one of Wes Anderson's most expensive movies, and it failed to earn back the investment at the box office. Critics can't seem to agree on this one, some calling it smug, ironic, and artificial, while others have praised it for its uniqueness, eccentricity, and whimsy. Number 8. The Darjeeling Limited a year after their father's funeral, three American brothers take a train voyage across India on a spiritual quest to find themselves and bond with each other. Starring Owen Wilson, Adrian Brody, and Jason Schwartzman. Written by Wes Anderson, Roman Coppola, and Jason Schwartzman. This movie is paired with a prologue short film, Hotel Chevalier, starring Natalie Portman and Jason Schwartzman, that takes place in Paris, France, two weeks before the Darjeeling Limited. Number 7. The French Dispatch The staff of the French Dispatch magazine decides to publish a memorial edition highlighting the three best stories of the last decade, an artist sentenced to life imprisonment, student riots, and a kidnapping resolved by a chef. Starring Benicio Del Toro, Adrian Brody, and Tilda Swinton. Honestly, there are so many well-known actors in this movie, you might want to check the IMDb credits. This was Wes Anderson's ninth movie with Bill Murray, his eighth with Owen Wilson, and his seventh with Jason Schwartzman. Number six, Isle of Dogs. An outbreak of canine flu leads the mayor of a Japanese city to banish all dogs to an island garbage dump. The outcasts embark on an epic journey when a 12-year-old boy arrives on the island to find his beloved pet. Written by Wes Anderson, Roman Coppola, and Jason Schwartzman. Characters are voiced by an all-star cast, including Brian Cranston, Edward Norton, Jeff Goldblum, Bill Murray, and Scarlett Johansson. Click on one of the links in the description for a complete list and all of the acting credits in this movie. Number 5. Rushmore. An ambitious teenager falls for a beautiful teacher, befriends a middle-aged industrialist, and starts a complicated war for her attention. Starring Jason Schwartzman, Bill Murray, and Olivia Williams. Written by Wes Anderson and Owen Wilson. This was the film debut of Jason Schwartzman, the son of Talia Shire, nephew of Francis Ford Coppola, and cousin to Nicolas Cage. Schwartzman came to his audition wearing a prep school blazer, which sported a Rushmore patch, which he made himself. Number 4. Moonrise Kingdom. A pair of young lovers make a secret pact and run away together into the wilderness off the coast of New England, which causes a local search party to fan out to find them. Starring Jared Gilman and Kara Hayward. Also starring Bruce Willis, Edward Norton, Bill Murray, and Francis McDormand. Written by Wes Anderson and Roman Coppola. Wes Anderson was heavily influenced by the movie Melody from 1971, and has stated that this film is essentially his remake of Melody. Number 3. Fantastic Mr. Fox. Bored with his current life, Mr. Fox plans a chicken heist against three local farmers who retaliate and seek revenge against the sly fox and his family. Starring George Clooney, 
Meryl Streep, and Bill Murray. Screenplay by Wes Anderson and Noah Baumbach. This movie is based on the 1970 novel Fantastic Mr. Fox by British author Roald Dahl. Number 2. The Royal Tenenbaums. The eccentric members of Royal Tenenbaum's dysfunctional family reluctantly gather under the same roof for the first time after two decades of betrayal, failure, and disaster. Written by Wes Anderson and Owen Wilson, starring Gene Hackman, Gwyneth Paltrow, and Angelica Houston. Also with Ben Stiller, Bill Murray, Luke Wilson, Owen Wilson, and Danny Glover. The hand with the BB lodged between its knuckles is not Ben Stiller's, but Andrew Wilson, the brother of Owen and Luke. When they were children, Owen fired a BB gun at Andrew's hand, and the BB has been there ever since. Number 1. The Grand Budapest Hotel A writer encounters the owner of an aging high-class hotel who tells him of his early years serving as a lobby boy in the hotel's glorious years under an exceptional concierge. Starring Ray Fiennes, F. Murray Abraham, and Tony Revolori. And as usual, this film has a huge cast. Written by Wes Anderson. This was Wes Anderson's highest grossing movie to date and highest rated on several of the movie websites. Thanks for watching. Check out the complete list on Letterboxd and IMDb. Links are in the description.